quickie tour of uh, where we are at Cotton Lane RV Resort. It was way too windy today. Here is a billiard hall and laundry room. The billiard hall has one pool table and some darts. Um, here's a laundry room. It uh, had $1.75 for washing and $1.75 for drying. There were a couple of big machines. I'm not sure how much they were. If you only needed a couple more minutes of drying, you were out of luck and had to pay another $1.75. This is the outside courtyard area outside of both of those areas, those rooms we were just in. It's between that and this big swimming pool. It's a huge pool. It's a really nice indoor pool and it has a pretty cool uh, hot tub area too. Yeah, where are the cocoons? That's what I wanted to know. <laughs> it had two little sunning areas on either side of the pool. This is like bocce ball and, and uh, shuffleboard, shuffleboard yeah. things like that. This is the front office area where you go to sign in when you arrive. It also has a big, uh, big room in there for dinners and that sort of thing. They have after hours registration. You sign yourself in. They even have an on-site makeshift pay post office. Yep, no pets. Okay, they allow dogs, but they're not allowed to go any bur but the dog run. Yeah, that's about it. It's a is good it, sand park. It is a good Sorry. sand park, so you're going to get your 10% uh, off. It's got some permanent residents, got quite a few permanent residents. That's one of them there with the building. It's really flat and very treeless. There's very few trees at all. Speed limit's about 15 throughout the park. Um, yeah, so you mix in a... RV and a permanent resident. RV permanent resident. And you are squished in here. Well, as you can see, we're really cramped in here. There's a little tree and a little teeny tiny pad, uh, cement pad. Oh, you can wash your car here too. <laughs> For free. <laughs> Over there along the fence. Which by the way, hose. yeah, which by the way, the fence is a view fence. Notice you can see mountains behind it. That's the only view out of the park. Yeah, oh, and here's the dog run. The dog can't run too fast or it'll crash into a wall. It's a very he, small dog run. But at least it has a tree and some chairs, so and, that's good. And it's a good place to let them roam. So here we are next to our neighbor and when our awning is out over our refrigerators and their awning was out in the front, they were like almost touching. So that's the Cotton Lane RV Park in Goodyear, Arizona. Um, one, two, three, four, or five stars, what would you say? We got a good SAM discount for a week and a half. It wasn't too bad, it was a little more above our budget than we wanted to pay, but it's okay. There's no cable, no nope. cable TV, there's no Wi-Fi. Um, you've gotta have your own- Antenna. Cell service and-, and Oh yeah. You know, uh, but the park offers no free Wi-Fi or anything like that. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, it was, it's kept clean. There's no rowdy kids, obviously. It's a 55 and older um, RV pl place. Listen to you. I know. <laughs> no kids <laughs> making it. noise. It was, it was convenient for us, even though most of our friends and relatives live almost an hour away from where we're staying in Phoenix. But we wanted to be here in Goodyear because we wanted to go to Goodyear Stadium and see a couple uh, spring training baseball games. So it was very convenient to that. It, the baseball stadium from here is only like five to 10 minutes away. Yeah. So not bad at all. No. Nope. I'd give it three. Yeah, I guess so. Um, because it's clean and um, they have some nice amenities, um, I would take out for them cramming you in together so tightly. I personally don't like the rocks that they park you on. It makes for a very unpleasant um, patio area. And the fact that the dog can't go anywhere but the dog run. So that was not fun.